how about uh, Kevin? I have an ATI Radeon. This mm. is this is getting into lots of numbers and okay. letters here. Numbers are important. AG AGP-9250, the rest of it doesn't matter. AGP is the <coughs> interface that it uses to plug into the computer. 9250 is the grade of the, uh, Graphics the, chip, card. the chip that's on that. Okay. Card, yeah. uh, worked fine with previous versions of Ubuntu from uh, version 7.04 mm -hmm. to 8. Point ten, uh, full comp is no crashes until Jaunty Jacklop nine point zero four mm -hmm. works for some time. Then machine enters an endless loop and hangs. Same on Linux Mint. Uh, tried installing ATI drivers. Uh, ATI driver installer eight point two four point eight um, by eighty six run. ATI driver installer eight point two eight. So he's he's installed the eight point two eight point eight driver and trying to go back to the two point uh, the twenty four point eight but is getting this message creating error. directory FGLRX install verifying archive Can't integrity all guarantee. good uncompressing ATI proprietary Linux driver eight point two eight and <laughs> so on. She's trying real hard. Uh, the what's gonna happen there, I'll just I can just hit that right now because that version of the driver eight version eight point two eight I mean, you're going back to 2006 for that driver. So mm -hmm. that's a really, really old driver. And why you're not seeing anything newer than that, I'm sure, for your card is because you've got that 9250. And the legacy driver cycle for AMD, which uh, bought out the ATI cards, as far as, I could, as far as I know, they start at 9500. So because you've got that 9250, you're not going to be getting new drivers for that card. So the 9500 and up are going to be seeing those legacy drivers up to date. Every, uh, I think it's every quarter, um, but your card is probably never going to see that. And when Jaunty came out, it had the latest version of Xorg, which is not compatible with the old, like the pre-legacy cards. So the 9250 is not going to be compatible. So your only options are really to either hope that they bring out a new driver, which is I, I can almost guarantee you that's not going to happen. And when they do, it's going to start at 9500. Um, so it's not going to happen for your card. Um, so you can either upgrade your card, which you can do with a fairly cheap card because you can get something like a 9500 or something to, to stay within the legacy uh, area, cheap, cheap old cards. But, um, or you can just step back to an older version of Ubuntu, maybe go LTS, hmm. keep your Xorg uh, to a version that's going to be compatible, but you're going to run into the exact same problem uh, coming up in the future because when, whenever you want to update that computer, you've got a, co a card that's completely not supported anymore. So yeah. not not good news, of course, but that's that's all she wrote. That's kind of where we're at with that. Yeah. Sorry, buddy.